Hello and welcome to my fourth video essay on uh, this time on Carol Churchill's 1994 play, The Striker. First of all, this is the scariest play I've ever read. Um, it also has the absolute scariest cover of any book I have ever or likely will ever see. Um, I have to keep the book resting face down when I'm not reading it, especially at night, lest I have extreme night terrors or day terrors for that matter. Uh, the play itself reminded me of a very strange BBC miniseries, or that movie The Wicker Man, um, or uh, a particularly strange radio head song or video. Um, um, to me the play read sort of like Old English, or like um, a pissed cockney woman trying to describe the previous night's events. Pissed means drunk. In, um, in British slang. It was difficult to get into the rhythm of the Scriker's speech at first, but once I did, I actually had a lot of fun. It lent itself well to being read aloud, and the crazy, almost ancient-sounding speech pattern made it seem Shakespe almost Shakespearean, especially while recited aloud. <clears throat> As someone who is fascinated by British culture, and its ancient pagan folk tales. I found myself transported to an exciting yet disturbing world. I found my, I found myself transported to an exciting yet disturbing world. I found myself transported to an exciting yet disturbing world that I was at least somewhat familiar with because I have that fairy book with the Alan Lee illustrations at home. Um so I was aware of brownies and the green lady and Jenny Greenteeth and they all haunted my childhood nightmares and will now likely make a terrifying comeback within my psyche, having now just read the Scriker and having looked through the fairy book again. Also, fairies seem to love taking babies, and this play reminded me a lot of the movie Labyrinth, <clears throat> starring David Bowie and Jennifer Connelly, which also features fairies taking a baby and dancing and music and David Bowie fondling three large golden balls in one hand. Uh, Carol Churchill is obviously delighted by the English lang language, and it makes her terrifying play all the more fun to read. Just don't stare at the front cover for too long. Um, if you go cross-eyed, it maybe looks slightly less heart attack inducing, but I still probably wouldn't do that either. Thank you. Club games. Do you love me? Are you playing your love game with me? I'm all crazy. I don't think you see. Mama, don't make me back now.